Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. It's Christmas. Happy Christmas everyone. Hopefully everyone got all the presents they deserved that they wanted for this glorious day. I won't hold your ear for too long, but I want to talk about this brand new box set that got announced on the Christmas Day preview. Piety and Pain. It will feature the Dark Eldar and Sisters of Battle. What is that you say? A box set without Space Marines? What kind of madness is this from Games Workshop? So the article opens up about the new Sister of Battle Palatine model that got previewed a couple of months ago. I myself thought that this was going to be like some new HQs that were getting released from Games Workshop. I never would have thought that they would have put Sisters in a box set um, with Dark Eldar, because, again, we'll get into the Dark Eldar stuff in a minute. Yeah, but that was something that was, wasn't in my head at all. I thought they were going to do some, like, Ecclesiarchy model, some priests and stuff, um, but she is going to be one of the main HQs in this box set, along with the Dark Eldar. Now, if we look what is in the box set, images in the background now, you can see the Sister of the Battle side, and you can see the Dark Eldar side. Um, this is kind of in hand-in-hand um, -hand with the upcoming Dark Eldar code. Codex. That's got to be dropping as well. It was supposed to, be, well, I say supposed to be, it was supposed to be dropping early 2021, but of course, with all the um, delays and stuff, I don't know when this is going to be coming now. But I think that when the Dark Eldar Codex comes out and the Dark Angel Codex and the Nurgle Codex, sorry, Death Guy Codex comes out, I predict that the following Codex after that will be the Sister of Battle, just because this box set is going to be the main thing that is probably going to be coming out early 2021. Now, hold on to your butts, because the probably the biggest thing about this box set, yes, it is a Dark Eldar, it is Sisters in a box set, oh, amazing, um, but it's a new Lilith Hesperex model. Now, we all knew that Lilith Hesperex was coming because people decoded some of the rumor engines, and it was her knives, and it was her hair, her feet, and stuff like that, so I personally knew that it's, it was, it's been coming now for a couple months but we've all been waiting for the actual reveal of this model i thought when the dark eldar codex dropped it was going to drop the dark eldar codex but no they've done it with the uh, box set instead when, well well when, when i say drop the dark eldar codex a lot of people have been telling me that she's gone to um yanari now or something i don't I, i'm so confused with all the eldar factions they're all heretics they all should be purged but yes um she apparently is still dark eldar so i'm just gonna say dark eldar with her and um, but the model itself um I like it. I like the pose. I like the action pose. Um, I'm not too sure about the face. Maybe it's just the way it's been painted. Um, but the base is pretty nice. I like, like that dead Eldar at the bottom of it. It's always, a, it's always a good reference when you post a dead Xenos at the bottom um, of the base. But I like the hair. I like. I, I, I do like like the fluid action -y of the pose. Like she, you know, she is leaping. That's what Eldar do. They like to leap off things and stab people with swords or you know shoot things out of their helmets because that is the Eldar way. Anyway, that is me done for another video. There's not really much more to talk about. There's some new Slaneshi stuff from AOS, but like I've always said, I'm not really into the AOS game, so I don't cover that. There's really no point in me covering something that I'm not interested in. Um, so yes, go and check the article out for yourself um, if you want to go and check out the AOS stuff. Um, give me your thoughts, feedback on the um, box set. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Sister of uh, Battle fans, Dark Eldar fans, or should I say Drakari fans? Um, tell me what you think about this box set. It's just a box set that you are going to be picking up if the price is right post it down below and we can have a nice little talk down there as we always do and um, once more i just want to wish everyone a happy christmas a merry christmas and um, thank you for the amazing support all this year you've been absolutely just amazing thank you from the bottom of my heart we got past a hundred thousand subscribers which is a goal which i never thought i would even dream of making so really thank you for all the awesome stuff you're all amazing and um, when 21 20 uh, when 2021 comes hopefully there's a primark and hopefully bigger and better things for the channel so uh, yes thank you have a great christmas enjoy your new year and bye bye